Welcome to the HFT Stocks and Options Commentary. I'm Pablo Navarro. Today is Wednesday, September 4, 2013. For the volatility index, the dollar weighted put call ratio on the VIX, we have a bearish reading on September, October, December, and January. As you can see here, the important month was September with 63% of the total premiums paid, and overall we have a bearish dollar weighted put call ratio on the VIX today. If we go to the SBX daily chart today, we were 0.8% higher for the day, very nice here. Finally breaking the 100 day moving average and closing above it. Next target here to the upside is the 50 day moving average. Right now trading at 1664, that's going to be important, 10 handles above it here. As you know, we have uh, tomorrow ADP number coming out and Friday we have non-farm payrolls. So that's going to be very important for this week to see how the non-farm comes. As you know, I'm looking for 1600 on SBX right now on the short term. Going to the Qs. Here we have the Qs up 1% for the day. And continue to go higher. You can see here we closed the gap we had before. Very nice here. Move higher with nice volume. If we go to IWM. IWM up 0.9%. Let's call it. Just closing at the 50-day moving average. Very nice pattern here. I believe this is a bearish formation for me. This is how I would trade it here. Nice risk reward to the downside with very little risk here. Going to the metals. GLD down 1.29% for the day. You can see here starting to break down here gold. I am bearish on gold. I'm not ready to jump short yet. Silver. Silver also down hard. Down 3% today for the day. As you can see here we have a couple of gaps here overnight as you could see there I'm looking for lower prices for SLB but I'm not ready to jump in yet they're short since I believe we're touching 17 again I don't need to rush here to the entry Apple Apple having a very nice day today up 2.07 percent trying to close above 500 but not there yet closing at 498.7 uh, Apple looks interesting here we need to break that descending uh, trend line we have here and then try to go for the for the highs of 513 if we do there there get there we would go to 520 that's the target here so short term pretty neutral on Apple until we break that line and then we're bullish Netflix Netflix up 1.19 percent up 292 as you know we're looking for 300 and then go above it looking for a new all-time high for Netflix Facebook Facebook down 0.2 percent for the day not much to worry about just consolidating Google there you can see Google here up 1.3 percent for the day bouncing here at that 100 day moving average next target for Google is 890 last chart we're gonna talk at LinkedIn getting sold off hard because of the new stock offering down almost 3% for the day you can see here the chart still looks good to the upside but we're gonna have to see and see how the reaction goes next uh, couple of trading sessions